<laughs> Which I think most of you have done now! <laughs> Hey guys, Productive Zidak here and welcome back to another Roblox video. Today I am in Meep City because the game hit 1 billion visits. It is the first Roblox game in history to hit that many visits and that's insane. So I thought why not celebrate by going into the game and having some fun. Now I was greeted with this beautiful screen saying Meep City hit 1 billion visits, thank you everyone. Have a free fra gift from us and then we can open our presents. Let's see what we get. Okay. 500 coins and 1 billion, which is like a statue, I guess. That's awesome. Okay, so today I wanted to talk about something, actually. I wanted to tell a small story while we play some Meep City. So I'm gonna head over to the shop because I wanna design my house in this video. But I wanna tell a story that I don't think I have told anyone. Um, Debert and I actually met Alex Neutron like super super long ago and uh, I'm gonna tell you about it let's go <laughs> right so the story of when Debra and I met Alex Neutron uh, is a story that was quite a while ago I think it was maybe back in 2016 or 15 something like that uh, it was many years ago uh, and it was kind of random actually. So what happened was that me and Debert was in a call. I think it was either on Skype or on Discord. Um, it was a while ago, I don't remember. Uh, but we were talking, we were hanging out, having fun. Uh, and then through the following feature, I think, one of us saw that Alex Neutron was online. And we were actually kind of big fans of him because we played Dodgeball, which is one of the games he has made, as you might know. Um, so when we saw he was online, we joined him, and we expected it to be like a full server so we couldn't get in, but we got in and we were so shocked because it was only him and us in the server, and there was like, always saw was this little place, which was like grass, and then there was a path, and there was like an arch building thing that you can, you could not walk through it yet, uh, but that's one of those teleportation things that you now have in Meep City, you know, the one with the signs that goes from the playground, the plaza, and stuff like that, uh, and it was also this building which looks like, like, I think it was two scoops of ice cream or something like that, uh, and that's of course the ice cream place that we have today, it looked way different back then because this was way before it was out, um, there was also a pizzeria which also looked way different and you could uh, you could only go into it and there was like just this room with tables and stuff like that. There were, there were no furnaces or whatever there is now, there were no pizzas that you could take or anything. Uh, so that was it, we just followed him around, he was walking around, we talked to him a bit if I remember right. Um, it was pretty cool actually. Uh, and there was like, I think the the, the the keyboard or the piano that's in the pizzeria, it was actually there back then. Uh, but we I don't think it was like done yet or something like that, but that's what I remember. Um, but it looked great and we were so impressed and we didn't know what this was, so it was really cool actually. Um, there was no spawn area, there were no playground or anything, there were no shops or anything, there were only the plaza which is where the pizzeria and the ice cream store and a few other locations is located, but back then there were only the pizzeria and the ice cream store and we then walked into the ice cream store with Alex Neutron and he showed us that you could pick up ice creams and you could eat them, it was so cool and we were so amazed and we were like this is going to be such a cool game in the future and look at it now, a few years later it has, it's the first game on Roblox to hit 1 billion visits. How amazing isn't that? Um, and I thought that was such a cool story so I wanted to share that with you guys because we haven't talked a lot about it with other people but it was really cool to actually meet Alex Neutron and to actually be some of the first people. Like I, I can certainly say that we were some of the first people to actually see any progress of Meep City. So that was really cool because it's now one of the top games and it's been for years now. I mean, <laughs> it's amazing. And again, great job to the devs. They, this game is absolutely brilliant. Um, yeah, but that was the story of how me and Debert met Alex Neutron. 
Right, so once again, congratulations to the team behind Meep City on 1 billion visits and being the first game to hit that milestone, that's insane. Um, keep it up guys, uh, and I hope you guys like this story, it is real actually, uh, told from what we remember, it was quite a while ago, so some details might have been missed, uh, or some stuff might have been sh um, told in wrong way because we don't remember correctly but i hope you guys liked it leave a like if you did and don't forget to subscribe to see more of my videos and i will see you guys in the next one bye